Hello guys, in today's video, this is the last video of the summer, we're going to be opening this Thomas and Friends magazine from Poland. So let's get into it. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to pull out the bag is this, which says Thomas and Friends. Um, and up here it says you get a present, which is a Bruno. And you also get um, some railway signs in the set. Also, let's zoom in. That's not classic Thomas. That's CGI Thomas. I'm, I've been scammed. How could they? Okay, so then we could do... Then we have Read with Mia. And then we could Color with Diesel. Or we could Count with Percy. And we also have two funny stories in here. Which I'm not going to read. Because I'm just that guy. <laughs> and then I have... List of traps. Yeah, we have a list of traps. Tasks. Good enough. <laughs> so, yeah. Also up here, it says... It helps develop the abilities of a preschool child. Which I am totally a preschool child. Mm -hmm. Very much. Okay, I'm gonna show you the inside of this now. I'm gonna put it like this. So we have Whiff, we have uh, Carly, of course this Carly had one. We have Bruno, Diesel, and Harold. We have the Fat Controller. Yeah, and then we have uh, Thomas in right here. Yeah, the Thomas right there. Boots, yeah, we got a lot of stuff in here. I'm not gonna do any of this stuff, but it's pretty cool. Nia, um, like some episode information. We have my bunny Duncan. Oh yeah, we always need him. Then we have some more episodes and then mm, like spot the difference. Yeah, I think stop the spot the difference. Coloring pages. So you can see Neo right here and these old for the Anaconda's up there. Then we have this maze. Yeah, and then we have this poster for a film. Um yeah, no, I'm not gonna watch that one. We have Carly, I think. Harold. Diesel and James is right there. The panda, we have even more Duncans. There's four Duncans. No, there's five Duncans. Put five Duncans on the screen. We have ducks, dogs, and we're going to turn on the style of Thomas at all. Oh, and there we go. CGI Thomas. There we go. It's CGI Thomas. And there he is with a monkey. And there he is. Somewhere. I don't, know. I don't watch that. No, blubber. Yeah, so then the shapes and this also. This, yeah. And here's the back, you can get puzzles also. So yeah, that was this thing. Yeah, so then I have this Bruno. Um, I did some research, there's like a whole bunch of these from different times, but I got the only, I got like a one pack set, which comes with Bruno and some um, things for like your railway. Some of the sets come with track, but I didn't get any, uh, which is okay. So let's open Bruno up. Okay, so this Bruno. Okay, so this is the company. But I'm pretty sure this is just all. I'm pretty sure this is just all stuff here. Yeah, and then see the other but that's good. So yeah, here we go now. Looks like it's not necessarily in the ink on, but it just continues to go on. And the stickers all over. I think it might be something a little bit, because it's a bit brighter right here. Look there. It also has 24. Um, you can't see it, but 24 going times later. Yeah. Here's the now. Look at it. Yeah. <coughs> I have this awesome sign. Extra sign. And it goes up and down. So it's just right there. I don't really know why it's here, because it's like it, but it's supposed to be the cars, but it's not going to be cars in the train. Then we have this rock sign for falling rocks. Like, rain drop. Yeah, you can't see that much. I want to have this dangerous sign. But it's very dangerous. So let me compare the model to the size of my Thomas. Okay, so I'm back, and yeah, here are the models. So let me go get Bruno from here. Let's see if he's better. So, here he is with the 
take long or take him play Thomas. Looks pretty sized with it. Looks like he's made for it because of the wheels. So now let's get this Thomas. The push one. Push one? No. Yeah, the, the, the metal Thomas. Okay, so he's a bit big. But it looks like they're the same size. But this connection, I don't have anything to connect to it. Except for maybe one thing. Okay, so I have this matchbox train and this carriage, which I got from my friend Ronin. You guys don't know him, but yeah, here it is. And this connection looks really similar to this one. So let's see if it actually works. So let me just. Put it on, and yeah, it works really well. I mean, let me show you guys. Okay, so you guys can see it's basically really flush with it, but you can't really move it that much, uh, unlike these. So yeah, but like the front wheel doesn't want to work that well. So uh, at least we know something that connects to it. And if you're asking, is Bruno is supposed to go backwards? Because he is a brake fan. So yeah. It's pretty cool. Now you can actually connect it to something. Okay guys.